I feel like a lot of people in our generation constantly complain about a lot of things, especially mm. when it comes to marriage. Mm. And then you who is single, they tell you not to speak on it because you're single. And I said this before, I think it's a stupid man who came up with the phrase that experience is the best teacher. I have people who wake up every day and choose to fight for their marriage, to fight for their individuality while still being a union. Hello my people, welcome back to the channel. Right now we go dive into one serious gist with a hot for town. Have you heard about Abibola Craig? That fine actress with Sabi Haxwell World. She done drop some hot takes about marriage we go make you think twice. So during one interview where she do with Trude, our media guru Abimbola come talk say she believes say marriage na scam. He be like say she know the play oh. At 38 years old, she don't talk and clear. Say no be say she no one marry, but she get her reasons. We make sense. She come to criticize this traditional way where people they see marriage, especially for women. You know, say them they expect women to carry all the load for house, manage everything, and still cater for their husbands. Abimbola even talks say. When them call you missus, it be like say them call you masters in residential servicing. Now serious matter be that to Eva. But me with Claire Ram, she know they against marriage. Oh. What did she really define a partner with Sabi himself? We get purpose for life. She talk him like this. All marriage is a scam. When I was small, my mom always told me marriage is an institution. She said when they call you missus. It stands for masters in residential servicing. Hey, that's one strong goal. She also explains, say she no fit day with any man we don't know who he be. And I go talk, say that one a serious requirement for any relationship. Hey, but Abimbola Craig no be just actress. She dey shine for other areas too. If it remember us as Tiwalade for the popular web series Skinny Girl in Transit. And don't forget, say she co-produced that big movie Super Rush, where everybody they talk about for 2019 alongside. Jade or Shiberu. But wait, you know, stop there. Earlier this year, she also opened up about some serious while where she face after brain surgery, which she do for 2014. She talk about how she did battle with nausea, insomnia, and weight loss. Now, so she did fear for her life, oh, but thank God, say she did okay now. So, what do you think about having Bola talk? You agree with her, say marriage Naska? Or you get your own opinion. Make you share your thoughts for space below. And as you watch this video reach end, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more juicy gist. So maybe no longer I'm too much here in the video. See ya. Getting married is not my biggest concern. It's getting married to the wrong person. So I'm looking for somebody who can come and take all of this imperfection. Yeah. I appreciate it for it. And I take yours as well. And then we move on. I keep saying that marriage for me is two whole people coming together to become wholesome. No broken people coming together. I feel like a lot of people in our generation constantly complain about a lot of things, especially mm. when it comes to marriage. Mm. And then you who is single, they tell you not to speak on it because you're single. And I said this before, I think it's a stupid man who came up with the phrase that experience is the best teacher. I have people who wake up every day and choose to fight for their marriage, to fight for their individuality while still being a union. And I guess only my mom and people that know me is the fact that, first of all, Abimbola Craig is shy. You heard me when I said I don't like attention. Yeah. It's not because I'm, oh my God, it's because I'm generally very shy. I was pregnant and my body was producing mm. milk. Wow. And so I was given two choices, either to take drugs for the rest of my life to reduce the tumor or to have... Surgery. surgery. Yeah. The amount of times they really poked me in that hospital mm -hmm. to just make sure that my sugar level was normal, mm -hmm. to make sure that my cholesterol, everything right. was... I went through a lot of injections. I had just taken a shower and I was lying down on my bed and I noticed that my top was wet by my left breast. Two hours after, I wake up again and it was wet. And so I was like, mm-mm. So I sit down on the bed and I remember pressing my breast and I saw milk. And I was like, this is crazy. Abimbala Craig talk about the scary brain tumor that she worried was going to take her life. And so we get to America and we go to Northside Hospital and they're like, okay, do an MRI and do a mammogram. Right. And then the MRI showed that I had a tumor resting on my pituitary gland. My war started after surgery. I was put on oxycodone. And by the third day, I couldn't sleep. Why she has a YouTube video that says marriage is a scam. So first things, all marriage is a scam. So when I was small, my mom told me marriage is an institution. They say when they call you missus, they call you it's masters in residential services. I'm not married, not because I don't want to be married. And if you're a man who doesn't know who he is, yeah, 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 yeah. you cannot Karabo Soto. be with me. Keteli Bata. Including how she reacted to the critical reviews of Glamour Girls. If I sit down here and tell you what everybody who worked on Glamour Girls went through, mm. shooting in Lagos, shooting in Abuja, shooting in Lebanon, First week, who? It was quite a I, I called my mother, I cried. And so I sit down there, when I hear this feedback, it hurts me for the people that know what they put into it. This 
It's one of those episodes that will touch and tug at your heart.